Katinerpak National Park is a Canadian national park. Located on the northeastern corner of Ellesmere Island in the Chikiktulik region of Nunavut, the most northerly extent of Canada, it is the second most northerly park on Earth after Northeast Greenland National Park. In Inuktitut, Katinerpak means, "...top of the world." It was established as Ellesmere Island National Park Reserve in 1988, and the name was changed to Katinerpak in 1999, when Nunavut was created, and became a national park in 2000. The reserve covers 37,775 square kilometers, 14,585 square miles, making it the second largest park in Canada after Wood Buffalo National Park. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Landscape. The land is dominated by rock and ice. It is a polar desert with very little annual precipitation. Much of the highlands of the park are covered in ice caps. These ice caps, and the glaciers that descend from them, date back at least to the last episode of glaciation. The park includes Barbeau Peak, which at 2,616 metres 8,583 feet is the highest mountain in Nunavut. <laughs> Wildlife Some wildlife, notably arctic hares, lemmings, muskoxen and arctic wolves reside in this national park, but sparse vegetation and low temperatures support only small populations. There is a very small peri caribou population as well. Other animal inhabitants include ringed seals, bearded seals, walruses, polar bears, and narwhals. During summer months, birds nest in the park including semi-palmated plovers, red knots, gyrefalcons and long-tailed jaegers. Common plants include dwarf willow and arctic cotton, in addition to grasses and lichens. Plant and animal life is more concentrated in the Lake Hazen region, which has a milder climate than the surrounding ice cap covered mountains and valleys. <laughs> <laughs> Human history Due to its high latitude and limited wildlife, there has never been any significant human presence within this part of Ellesmere Island. The pass from Tanquary Fjord through to Lake Hazen shows evidence of being used by Arctic people since about 5,000 years ago. Tent rings and food caches show that the area was visited by pre-Dorset, Dorset and Thule people, the ancestors of modern Inuit. The east and north end of the island was used as a starting point for various polar explorations. Fort Conger was an early Arctic exploration research base, and is now maintained as a federal heritage building. <laughs> Park Parks Canada maintains Warden Stations and Gravel Air Strips at Tanquary Fjord Airport, Lake Hazen and Ward Island. Tanquary Fjord and Lake Hazen are the main access points for tourists. Beyond these warden stations, there are no facilities within the park itself. Two backpacking routes are the route between Lake Hazen and Tanquary Fjord, and a loop around the Ad Astra and Viking ice caps, both approximately 100 km In 2004, the park was one of nine sites added to Canada's tentative list of potential World Heritage Sites. Gallery. See also List of National Parks of Canada List of protected areas of Nunavut Arctic Cordillera <laughs>